Hi, I'm Dr. Leif Smith, and today I want to talk about another book recommendation that I have. This book really changed the way I think about things in my life. I found this book when I was a junior in college. So this is back in the 1990s, long ago before social media. And we didn't have the resources back then that we did, that we do now. And so I am, have always been an avid reader. And for some reason I came across this book and I was getting over a breakup, a particularly difficult breakup. I was severely depressed for most of four or five months. And what helped me get out of it wasn't therapy. It wasn't someone else. It wasn't finding a new person to date. It was this book. And this book changed the way I think about things. And it teaches you that it's your response, the way you look at things, the way you frame what happens to you in your life matters. The way you frame it determines your response and it determines whether you're gonna have an anxious or neurotic, highly anxious response or if you're gonna have a calm and rational response. So that being said, the book is A New Guide to Rational Living. When I was in grad school, I, I also had the um, privilege to go to a speech by Dr. Albert Ellis, who was one of the uh, premier uh, psychologists in the cognitive therapy uh, field. And so I got to see him and he was so entertaining. He died shortly thereafter. This was the late 90s when I was in grad school. Um, but I'm so thankful for the work and for his contributions to the field of cognitive therapy. And he is the inventor of rational emotive behavior therapy. We know it as REBT. And this book right here, this is my second or third copy because I lent out the other ones. I have a habit of lending my books out when I enjoy them and I never get them back. So this is like my third copy. Go and get it. This book will change how you think about things so that you have better outcomes and better responses and you feel more peaceful and more rational in your life. I'm Dr. Leif Smith. Thanks for spending a couple minutes with me and I'll see you in the next video.